Lakini like nimemiss kupiga nduru. All right, welcome to the quiz show where if you know, you know and if you don't, we confirm it as pake ya host Buddha Boss. Hapa leo niko na an all ladies show. Ai. Ah, I mean. <laughs> Nikujibamba kuruka, I hope Aimanishi mzuri ni kama tunachagua madem peke yake inategemea na order ya request venye zimekuja na wajua hapo kwa online mnaweza anza kuniuliza maswali ngumu ngumu na staki. Let's find out contest azuri kina nani? Madam what do you do? What is your name? Uh, my name is Joy Imamai. Im Imamai. Imamai. Ah okay. Yes. Yes get jina kai. Yes. All right, what do you do Joy? I'm a pharmacist. Ai Pharmacist. Yes. First pharmacist on the show. I can leo zito. Na penda hiyo. Karibu sana Joy. Madam, what is your name and what do you do? My name is Veronica Njambi. Yes, Vero. And I'm also a pharmacist. You're also a pharm. <laughs> Put some weight. Eh? Vero na Joy eat in your pharmacist in it was incredible. Incredible. Eh ni 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 pharmacist. Mpaka tumepea rangi ya eh capsules. Karibuni sana. One more time, I said the Incredibles. Yes. I like it. Madam, what is your name and what do you do? My name is Faith Ida Kavaya. I'm a student. Faith Ida, student. What you are doing? At Kenya Institute of Mass Communication. Ah, hey, hey. I study TV program production. What you are mass com? Na juu muda tu zumbu apa kumbutandao. Karibu sana. Ni kudaza Faith, ni kuite Ida, ni tume jina gani kwa show? Faith. Faith. Okay. Sawa. Sawa Faith. Madam, your name and what you do? Uh, my name is Maureen Gitonga. Yes. I'm a student at Daystar University. Daystar University? Yes. I don't even scare Daystar University. You must scare when you are to Kenya Mass or Nongi. Anyway. <laughs> yes, Maureen, what's your name? I do public relations. Public relations? Yeah. All right. <laughs> Maureen and uh, Faith. Timian, you need what? The blacks. The blacks. <laughs> ah. Ah. The yo. Yeah. The blacks. All right. <laughs> team the blacks versus team incredibles. I'm one of a pebble on a kufano ani. SMS line triple one triple four triple one. We get this one going. We begin with our quick fire trivia. Of course, ten questions are going to be asked. Sixty seconds is the time limit. Every correct answer hundred points. If they don't know the answer. Wisdom dictates. What do you say? Umeanza na no idea. Anyway, wacha wacha litaanza na hisa hii maana kuna watu wanakawa kwa na idea. Hey, this one's have no idea. <laughs> Joy and Vero, I would like to begin with you. I don't know if you guys are ready. Yes, we are. Quick question. Yes. What do you think is the easiest part of this show? Vero the easiest easiest mboga sana back to school back to school napenda hiyo napenda hiyo i like it i like it what about it wasn't the hard one for you guys <laughs> tutakuja kwa the easiest joy if you're ready your time officially begins now which is the closest celestial body to the earth uh, hmm? is that a pass Saturday. incorrect the fear of which creature is known as arachnophobia the pass arachnids arachnids spiders sorry spiders spiders correct what is the name of the element with the chemical symbol he h e helium correct which organ covers the entire body and protects it skin correct who invented the first functional telephone the um, pass good what are the three states of matter solid liquid and gas correct frogs are reptiles or amphibians uh, amphibians correct which nutrient plays an essential role in muscle building? The pass. Incorrect. Yeast belongs to which kingdom of organisms? Kingdom. Yes. Uh, fung fungi. Correct. What two things can you never eat for breakfast? The pass. Can you never eat for breakfast? Yes. The pass. Time is ticking. Your time is up. Wow. Correct answer. Lunch and dinner. <laughs> sure. <laughs> <laughs> ah, <laughs> I knew it. 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 I knew it.
muscle building proteins. Uh, Alexander Graham Bell was the first one to discover and come up with the telephone as we know it. And of course, the closest celestial body to the earth is the moon. Now we know you guys have a serious start. Ah! Pharmacist. Six questions correct. 600 points. Now, Penda, yo. Penda, yo. Tumblot. What is the easiest part for each Easiest. It was a magnificent segment in a wagon bog. Back to school. Ah, ah, okay. <laughs> to All right. Are you ready? Yes. Hi. Your time officially begins. Now, true or false? Yogurt is produced by bacterial fermentation of milk. True. Correct. A bull is a male cow that has not been castrated. When castrated, what does it become? Uh, cow. A cow. <laughs> <laughs> Incorrect, we'll add you five seconds. All animals need food, air, dash to survive. Food, air, and dash to survive. Is that a pass? Water. Water, correct. What is Earth's only natural satellite? What? What is Earth's natural satellite? Um, is that a pass? A pass. Good. What goes up and never comes down? Is that a pass? Gravity. Pass. I, I can't remember that, yeah. Pass. Pass. Oh. <laughs> what part of the plant conducts photosynthesis? Photosynthesis. Leaves. Leaves. Correct. I like it. How does a dog express happiness? Barking. Barking. In. Correct. Which group of animals have scales? Uh, fish. Fish. <laughs> fish is a reptiles, group. Reptiles. 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 Correct. <laughs> <laughs> Name an animal starting with the letter U. Any. Is that a pass? Your time is ticking. Time is ticking. Your time is ticking. You. Is that a pass? You. And time <laughs> is up. What are you doing? I'm going to tell you what I'm doing. I'm going to tell you what or Uriol. I don't know how it's pronounced. <laughs> That's a ship. Uakari, that's a monkey. <coughs> Unau, it's a sloth. Uganda and Shrew, Achins. Now, we know. Welcome to the quiz show where <laughs> a dog expresses happiness by wagging off the tail. Now we know what never go what goes up but never comes down, your age. <laughs> when a bull is castrated, it is known as a steer. A steer. We keep on learning. We learn something new. You guys have done well. You've gotten one, two, three questions correct, if I'm not wrong. No, four questions correct. Mulipata yogurt pia. Four questions correct. 400 points for the blacks. Next. You guys have an opportunity to chagua sports. History, I'm entertainment. Join a vero, choose wisely. Uh huh. Entertainment. Joy, entertainment. Yeah. Hi, I don't want to get this out. Okay. 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 One. One. In. Correct. In music, what does BPM stand for? BPM. Yes. Is that a pass? Beats per minute. Beats per minute. Beats per minute. I'll give you that one. <laughs> I'll give you that one. What five letter word becomes shorter when you add two letters to it? Is that a pass, Veronica? Pass. Good. Name three comedians who were the face of the comedy show in True Colors. True, true Colors. Is that a pass, Joy? True Colors. In True pass. Colors. Is that a pass? Pass. pass. Good. What is DMX's real name? Pass. Pass. All right. Who was the host of the comedy show Offside? Offside. Yes. Is that a pass? Pass. All right. 
What are uh, what? <laughs> Name the comedians who made up the comedy trio of ridiculous. That's a pass, Veronica. KJ. KJ. Time is ticking. Pass. Pass. <laughs> Has also passed. <laughs> KJ, you're right. Walter Mongare, Tony Njuguna, ridiculous trio. Ha, in two colors. Mdomo Bagi, Kajairo, and Churchill. Now we know the host of the comedy show Offside. We had Captain Otos and Obina. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, when you're on a car, you're going to show Kenya. What five-letter word becomes shorter when you add two letters to it? Short. What? Uh, yeah, it's like ER, it becomes shorter. Short. <laughs> oh, yeah. How many months of 28 days? All the months. All of them of 28 days. But, oh, yeah. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Even a month of 31 days, Apo. Aki has 28 days. Apo. Apo. <laughs> Apo. <laughs> December is 28 days. <laughs> it was. But you can How many months of 28 days? Only. Only. <laughs> only. Only. only 28 days. <laughs> yeah. No point. I don't know if I'm going to pay it. I'm Hmm? One question correct. One hundred additional points. Seven hundred points. <laughs> Fourteen incredibles. Hi, what you go? Sports? History. History. If you make that, you make that your sports na conviction in here. No, na nika me wisdom. Morin, if you're ready, so am I. Your time begins. Now, what disease was eliminated in 1979? That's um, a pass? No, 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 wait. Wait, your time is ticking. Okay. Thank you. Which treaty ended World War I? Oh, God. That's a pass? Thanks. Thank you. What Good. came after the Bronze Age? The Bronze Age? Yes. That's a pass? Oh, God. Oh, God? <laughs> Just pass. Thank you. New York was known by a different name before 1664. What was the name? That's a pass. Thank you. Where was the Titanic headed to before it sank? Uh -uh. <laughs> um, US. America. Sorry. America. It's going to America. <laughs> It is true, it was going to America. <laughs> New York in particular, I'll give you that one. Uh, Where tomatoes, potatoes, chilies, and a whole load of other things were brought to Europe in the 16th century. They are not from Europe originally. Where did they come from? Egypt. That's a pass? Uh -uh. Pass? Thank you. Is it? Africa. Africa! Correct! Potatoes. <laughs> potatoes. <laughs> it is correct! Cleopatra had an imaginary friend called Hamish. True or false? Hmm? True. Ah, your time is up. <laughs> and that is correct. It is true. <laughs> hey, hey. Wala la. Yeah. Yeah. The Titanic was coming from Southampton, England, headed for New York. Before it sank Mali in between. All right. New York was originally known as New Amsterdam. <laughs> After the, the Bronze Age, we had the Iron Age and the Treaty of Versailles. I hope that's correct. French pronunciation is a treaty that ended World War I. And in 1979, smallpox was officially kicked out of the world. <laughs> Hopefully. <laughs> All right, you guys have gotten three questions correct. Seven. Which means you are at 700 points and it's officially a tie. A tie. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Next challenge two truths and one lie. This is the quiz show.
We are on to our next challenge of two truths and one lie. The task at hand is to figure out which of the three statements to Nasoma is false. We can discuss, and yes, we can discuss. No snatching points. <laughs> <laughs> Since it is a tie, I began with the Incredibles. I will switch over to Team Blacks. These are your three statements. One. The continents have been moving their location for millions of years and will continue to move. True or false? Statement number two. All radioactivity is man-made. True or false? Statement number three. Electrons are smaller than atoms. You have got five seconds. Kindly discuss and tell me your team answer. Five. Four. Three. To Maureen, what's the answer? Um, the continent have been moving their location for millions of years and will continue. Of course, to go up and to join a coming continent in a song. So I'm a two quail, but you might not know. Uh, no, it is all good. You are. Oh, where's the Jew? I can't move a shoe song. In a song, it moves. Oh, in a song. Ah, okay. Ah, yeah, by the way. Electrons are smaller than atoms. It is true. It is true. Which means the false statement is statement number two. <laughs> Believe it or not, it is true <laughs> that continents have been moving. Haya. Na shanga tule mwenye ni noti za lukua nafanya nini. Alionea wapi. Anyway, over to Tip Incredibles. You have an opportunity of taking the lead. These are your three statements. Lasers work by focusing heat waves. Statement number two. Blood makes up about 8% of your total body weight. Your eyes blink around 20 times a minute. 20 times a minute. Vero, what's your team answer? You've got five seconds. 20 times a minute. Vero, nipa jib. The false statement Yes. is the first statement. The first statement is the first statement. So let us work by doing what? My, uh, my understanding is... Yes, your understanding, Joy. <laughs> a little louder. Laser mm. work by focusing maybe light. Maybe. Yeah. Maybe. One something that is sure. We'll go with that for now. You will go with that. So you blink 20 times in a minute, right? Yes. But I'm going to keep on going. I'm going to keep on going. I'm going to keep on going. Yes, Yona. Yes, Yona. Okay, at a minute, Yona, you quail. Let me tell you for free. Statement number three. That's true. Statement number one. <laughs> Correct for statement is statement number one. It is true. Let us operate by focusing light and not heat. Your explanation is also correct. I like it. 800 points back in the lead. Team Incredibles. Ilazima ni vute pumps. This one. Taking a short commercial break. To Kirudi. Guess the meaning of the word. Mapenda uh, hii. Come back to the quiz show. We have already covered quick fire trivia. We have also covered two truths and one lie. Our next challenge is guess the meaning of the word. We want to ask them to pick out from our options the correct synonym of the words we shall be uh, giving out to them. Here we can discuss Otiangu, and yes, we can snatch points. Leading at 800 points, the Incredibles. Your first word is noisome. Options are A, annoying, B, general, B, a C, repeat, D, turn, which is the correct synonym, joy. Uh, 
A, B, C, or D. Okay, yeah, you can discuss. Uh, and now you have three seconds to do it. Your time is up. Um, annoying. Annoying? Yeah. A. Show about it. Yes. <laughs> Maureen, what do you think? Annoying. You're annoying? Yeah. All right. Let me tell you, it is annoying. Yeah, it's annoying. <laughs> 100 points. <laughs> Can you make it 800 points? Your word is asperity. Options are A, flight. B, harshness. C, instigate. D, enjoy. Asperity. Faith. A, B, C, O, D. Asperity. Three seconds to go. Your time is up, Faith. Enjoy. 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 I like it. I like it. I like it. Very nice. For the, just for the avoidance of doubt that I asked the other side. What do you think? Enjoy. Enjoy. Yeah. Yeah. Asperity is to enjoy yourself that you have the correct answer. In other words, could you enjoy? <laughs> correct answer is B. Harshness. <laughs> no point. All right. Your word is sapient. A, engage. B, wild. C, wise. D, sign. Sapient. Veronica. Wise. Wise. Sapient. Yes. Sapient. Yes. Sapient. Wise. <laughs> Maureen. Um, wild. Hmm? Wild. Wild. All right. Yeah. So, yeah. Uh, correct answer. B. Wild is not it. It is not it. D. Sign is not it. Correct answer. C. Wise. <laughs> 100 points! Your next word, calumny. A, intimate. B, correct. C, polite. D, slander. Faith, calumny. Talk to me. A, B, C, O, D? Polite. Polite. You agree? Yes. All right. Where what do you think? Slander. Hmm? Slander. Joy, you agree? Yes, yes, I do. You do? Yes. You said slander. Who am I? Slander. Correct. I like Hi. it. <laughs> <laughs> ah, oh. I've lost count. Mukongapi. One thousand. One thousand one hundred. One thousand one hundred. You get that out? Eight hundred. I hope. <laughs> one thousand one hundred points. 800 points. Next challenge is spell the word. I like it. <laughs> this is the quiz show. Our next challenge is spell the word. We can still discuss and we can still snatch points. Leading at 1,100, you get to go first. This is your statement. The medieval orthography of English even lays traps for you. Oh, huh. Hold that thought. <laughs> I've read the wrong statement. <clears throat> Let me read the correct one. All right? Mm -hmm. He was of reprobate mind. Spell for me reprobate. Joy. Uh huh. Reprobate or reprobate? Um, R. E. P. P. R. R. O. O. B. B. A. A. T. T. E. Would you like to reconsider your answer? No. We'll settle with that. Please settle. <laughs> Same. You're also settling? Yes. <laughs> okay. Let me also settle. <laughs> Correct spelling. I like it. 100 <laughs> points. <laughs> <laughs> the story got me flabbergasted. Spell for me, flabbergasted. Faith, you seem to be ready already. Flabbergasted. Flabbergasted. What is it? Uh, 
Your time is almost up. Let's go. F L L A A B B A A G G A A S S T T E E D Faith. Would you like to change your answer? No. Okay. Okay. Joy. Yes. What do you think? Um This is what you think. All right. It's F F L L A A B B B B E E R R G G U U S S T T E E D. I'll ask you one question, John. Just one question. Is it F L A or F L U? F L A. Think about it. Yes, it's A. Okay. You can we change? Can you change? Yeah, you can change. Uh, After the show. Correct spelling. F L A. Double B. E R G A S T E D. Damn, so close. So close. You're almost there. Almost there. I hope you get something here. A tendentious reading of history. Spell for me tendentious. Vero, let me hear from you on this one. Tendentious. Aha. T. T. E. E. N. N. D. D. E. E. C. All right. I. Yes. O. Yes. U. Yes. Where do we have a double? I'm asking. I'm not saying it's there. Just asking. What do you think? There's no double. Nowhere. Yeah. Whatsoever. No. All right. All right. Maureen. Now you can give me. <laughs> now you can spell. Uh huh. Um. T. T. E. E. N. N. D. D. E. E. C. C. I. I. O. O. U. Yes. S. Do you think there's a double anywhere? Do you think there's a double? I You sure? But can you mean it? Confirm. I don't think so. You don't think so? All right. What do I think? Correct spelling. T E N D E N T. I O U S not C. <laughs> I know. I know in your mind you say my tendency, tendentious. You said tendentious. It is true. Tendentious. 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 It is like that. I can put a cuban into a cuna points. The end is silent. Iki tu, iki tu ayi taka ju makasiriko. Quaint country cottages. Yeah. Spell for me quaint. What? Quaint. Faith. Quaint. quaint. I'll give you a hint. Quaint. Quaint. All right. What's the spelling, Faith? Wait one minute. Let's go. This is hard, but all right. Q. Q. U. 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 A. A. I N T. I N T. I N T. Quaint. Think about it one more time. Q. Q. U. Mm. E. E. I. Q. Q U E. Q U E N T. Q U E N T. That's the final answer. Seems like. Seems like. Oh no, let's go with the first one. Sorry. Let's go with the first one. What was the first one? Remind me. Uh, Q U A I N T. Q U A I N T. That's the final answer. U A I N T. You stick with it. You die with it. You die with it. Yeah. Rest in peace. Please repeat the same. Quaint country cottages. Spell for me, quaint. Uh, 
Mm -hmm. Yes, Vero. Uh, what I think. What do you think? Q. Q. U. 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 E. E. N. T. N. T. Maureen, it is you who changed the answer, not me. Damn. All right, for the avoidance of doubt. Correct spelling. Q. Use. A. I. N. T. Yes. Correct. I was right. I was right. I like it. No. <laughs> 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 At last. At last. You get a 900 points if I'm not wrong. <laughs> My God. At last. <laughs> Next <laughs> challenge. <laughs> Guess the logo. <laughs> this is the quiz show. Our next challenge is Guess the logo. The task is easy peasy. Correct brand identif identification from the images we will display. We can still discuss. We can still snatch points. At 1,200 points, our leaders, the Incredibles. This is your first image. Vero and Joy. Tell me the brand name I'm looking for. There we go. Aquafresh. Yes. Aquafresh. Aquafresh. Yes. What do you think? Same. You think same? Yeah, I go first. I also want to think same, but let's find out. Is it Aqua Fresh? Yes, it is. 100 points. All right, this is your next image. Yes, Vero. Ariel. Ariel? Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. Maureen? Ariel. Ariel? Yeah. Who am I? <laughs> is it Ariel? Yes, it is. 1,400 points. Can you make it 1,000 points? It is possible. This is your image. Hmm? <laughs> Faith. Faith, then you may react like it's <laughs> All right. What do you think, Faith? Elianto? Yes? Elianto? Elianto? <coughs> Elianto? I think let's just go with Elianto. Alright, we go with Elianto. We go with Elianto. Elianto? Yeah, yes. Alright, Joy? Yes. Uh, sa salit? Sa? Salit. Salit! Alright! Salit! Is it solid? Whatever that is. Or is it? What did you say? Elianto. 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 <laughs> Let's find out. Many guys. <laughs> yeah, you thought about it? I hope so. All right. Your next image is this one. He in on a kidogo. Kanakwamba. In a tegemea. No pande mutua mege mea. Faith. Yena ka maji mezidi unga. Join. Veronica. Pass. Pass. What's your wildest guess? Um. Nia Chakula. Nia I like it. It is true. It is true. Sub? No, not sub. Yes? You don't know. All right? Joseph and James. Umesema Nia Chakula. Let's find out. Chakula Kipi. What's the correct answer? Um. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> As I said, 
Musijali ilikuwa inategemea unaegemea ufanye gani I understand you guys are on the right side maintain hata muzisikie uchungu by the atukambali Well ah maintain ni map maana mko no point unfortunately we take a commercial break and so far 1400 points 900 points anything can happen on the quiz show will there be an upset today let's find out after this shot commercial break <laughs> Welcome back to the quiz show where if you know you know if you don't we confirm it so far so good 1400 points for our leaders the incredibles and at 900 points we have team blacks our next challenge is guess the price what yangu ni mboga sana na tafuta bei ya supermarket we we'll display the product you give me the uh, your price guess if it is within our range correct answer First product, Raha drinking chocolate 200 grams. Mtihani ni kwa 200 grams. Joy. What's the answer? 200 grams. Talk to me. Yes. What's the price, Joy? One twenty, joy. Vero. What's for that ketchup you bring? Muna kwa mana one twenty. So. One hundred. One hundred. I like it. Thank. One ten. One ten. Yeah. One forty. One forty. One forty. One fifty. One forty. One fifty. One forty. One fifty. Choose one. Um. One. One. 130 130 All right it's 200 130 You've decided Is it 130 is it 100 Correct price range is anything between 170 to 100 or rather 200 Kenya shillings <laughs> No point on that one Next product Dettol surface cleaner pine 900 ml 900 ml Veronica 900 ml If you know the price of 1 liter tell me the price of 900 ml Yes Vero 940 940 Kenya shillings So For every ml, one shilling, 40 bob ni ya chupa. Acha tukwame na hiyo. Aki kwa meni. Fei? 1,000. Kena shillings? Deto. Deto? Correct price range. Anything between 600 Kenya shillings. And 650 Kenya shillings. <laughs> no point. No point. Over to you. Dental shower gel fresh 500 ml. 500 ml. 500 ml. If I were you all do quick mathematics. Quick mathematics. Morin. Kidogo, one minute. One minute. Yes. You have only a few seconds. What's the answer? 500. 500. 
Corinne, can you do something to that price? I don't know. I don't know. It's your choice. It can be higher or lower, but can you do something to that price? Faith. Yes. 550? I like it. Vero? 575. 570. <coughs> I changed the answer. <laughs> <laughs> what can you do to that price? Five. I don't know if it I don't know if it is to increase or reduce. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. It's your choice. It's your choice. Yes? Five uh... 580. 580. All right. 580. 550. Correct price range. Anything between 790 uh -huh. to 860 kaya shillings. This is nice. 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 This is it was the Guinness uh, uh, <laughs> living supermarkets uh, isn't obeying. Hi, final no. product of this challenge. Dorman's granule instant coffee, two grams. Two grams. Two grams. Granule instant coffee. Dorman's. 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 Sorry? 30 bob. 30 bob. I like it. Just for, would you like to change it or you're confident? You're good? Are you feeling good? Let's take the risk. Take the risk. Joy. Six bob. Six bob. As in, six. Yeah. Can you shillings? Because I asked them, I'll ask you, would you like to change it? Just to be sure we are, everybody has gotten the fair share of uh, opportunities. No. No? Good price line is anything! Between! Hmm. Five Kenya shillings? <laughs> to ten Kenya shillings? One hundred points for the incredible. <laughs> you're two grams, you're thirty. You are going to get on the No, we are at one thousand five hundred points. Nine hundred points. Mutavuka, Musiogope, because we are coming to the segment that both teams said is easy peasy. Back to school. Ah, yeah. Alright, this is the quiz show we are on to our final challenge of this evening and according to our contestants, the easiest. So this is gonna be one that is full of marks, Otuamungu, full of marks. Motuama Pasi. Four subjects, of course, Kiswahili is compulsory, science, mathematics, ICT. Those ones are optional. We begin with our leaders. This is quick for a trivia so we could discuss. Kilendo na pambana na hali yake, ninge penda ni yanze nawe, joy, ukiwa uko tayari. Sawa, sawa. So nina kula kwanza, tegua kitenda wili, akiondoka hatu mwoni. Peter? Giza. Peter? Giza. Giza, umepata. Baridi ikiwa kali, tuwasema baridi? Shadidi. Shadidi, umepata. Tofautisha sita na kusita. Kutufusita ni na namba, uh -huh. mahari, uh -huh. na kusita ni ku, kugugu, kugugumiza. Kugugumiza? <laughs> si hazba yu kugumiza, lakini nimekuelewa haya, saha ntakupa. Majira ya mvua ndogo uituwa je? Majira ya mvua ndogo. Naam. Muda wako yoma, Veronica? Pita. Hasante. Mutoto wanzi ni mbu, ama mbu, rather, mbu. <laughs> Mtoto wabata ni? Kiyoyo. Kiyoyo, umepata. 
majina hayo hayakupendeza kwa umoja jina hilo halikupendeza umepata ah 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 napenda hiyo ah awesome 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 swali moja peke yake liliwasumbua majira ndogo ya mvua tuaita vuli vuli lakini mmepata maswali matano sahihi mmejongezea alama tano hivi sasa mko na alama ngapi 2000 Elfu mbili. Da. Da da da. Haya, Morin. <laughs> na Faith. Najua hili pia litakuwa mboga jinsi ambavyo mlisema ni mboga. Swali so, lako la kwanza. Dwara dufu ni umbo gani kwa kimombo? Dwara dufu. Eh eh, wewe ndio anajibu. Dwara dufu. Sako. Sako. Umenoa. Mtoto wa bata mzinga ni Morin. Kijibata. Kijibata. <laughs> Sabahan, kijibata. Haya, umenoa. Ukigawa mraba mara mbili, utasalia na umbo gani? Aha. Mstatili. Mstatili, umepata. Napenda hiyo. Shahada kwa kimombo ni shahada shahada naam oh 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 pete pete ah! anaendesha ndege huitwa naam faith pita rubani rubani ni ukweli lakini yeye alikuwa anafaa ajibu pole sana sitawafa andika kwa wingi kuku huyu anapenda mbuyu Mhm. Koko huyu anapenda mbuyu. Muda wako yoma? Kuku hawa wanapenda mabuyu. Kuku hawa wanapenda mabuyu? <laughs> Kuku hawa wanapenda mabuyu. Umepata. <laughs> Shahada, degree. <laughs> Mtoto wa bata mzinga sio kijibata kifaranga. <laughs> Dora dufu oval. Dora dufu oval. Haya, umepata ngapi? <laughs> umepata swali moja, mbili. Maswali mawili sahihi. Mmejongezea alama mia mbili. mko na alama elfu moja. Mia moja. Lead us 2000. I wish you guys can finish strong science mathematics ICT science science I thought so I thought so Nilijua mtarukia science hiyo nilijua hata nilikuwa nishaichagua Haya all the best Vero let's finish strong first question how many teeth does an adult human have that you correct what two things do bees collect and use to create honey uh Pollen? Yes. And uh, nectar. Correct. What does DNA stand for? DNA. Yes. Deoxynucleic acid. Deoxyribonucleic acid. acid. I'll give you that one. Correct. What is the chemical symbol for the element oxygen? O. O. Correct. What does the acid compound HCl stand for? Hydrochloric acid. Correct. How many bones do sharks have in their bodies? Sharks. Yes. Thirty. Thirty. It's correct if you remove three. Okay. <laughs> I was surprised to learn sharks have no bones. My god. Hey, we keep on learning. You guys have done a super fantastic job. Five questions correct. 500 points. 2000. 500 points do you know that the leading team so far which are three teams actually are at 2700 points so you guys were so close joining the top tier yeah what wangu atani madaktari 
Unasema ikuwa haikuwa fair. <laughs> Don't worry. Muko na mathematics, muko na ICT. Mnachagua gani? Mao ICT. 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 What do we call the brain of a computer? CPU. Correct. Which of these is not a function of a CPU? Store data, carry out program instructions, perform arithmetical operations. Perform arithmetical operations. Correct. The primary goal of a computer is to turn data into. Is that a pass? Um, data into. Is that a pass? Pass. 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 All right. Once information is input into a computer, it becomes. Correct! It is that! <laughs> a computer portable and easy to carry by travelers is? Um, tab. A tab? Tab phone. A tab phone! Incorrect! <laughs> <laughs> What's the world's most powerful computer called? Faith? That is officially? Smartphone. A smartphone. <laughs> 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 the world's most powerful <laughs> computer is called a smartphone. <laughs> <laughs> I am happy. Nimfrai. <laughs> Japanese supercomputer Fugaku. Supercomputer. A computer portable and easy to carry. Aki ni rejoi utapata. Laptop. 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 Fresh elifanyo kasema vitu zingine za maajabu. The primary goal of a computer is to turn data into information. Into information. You guys have gotten two questions correct. 200 points. 1,300 points here on chairs on this show. Eh? Three. Oh, sorry. Yes. Three points. My bad. I apologize. 300 additional points. You're at 1,400 points. Maureen Mulisema, back to school is the easiest. You agree? To the same level. Munaruka vuti kumi na bili, fey. I want to make pata mingi. Awe! But all the best. Our winners, Karipuri Sana. My pharmacists, you guys have done super well. If you believe you've got what it takes to be on this show. Nasikia watu wengi wakisema ukiwa nyumbani this show is easy peasy. Ukikuja kwa ground vitu ni tofauti. SMS line is 3114411. Let's keep our conversation going kwenye mtandao at Freddy Buda Boss at Switch TV KE. Tufanya ile kitu aspake. Our winners wakishinda wanatufungia na dance. Eh? Okay. All right. Every Wednesday and Thursday only on Switch TV. Eh? Mutuangu wa life,